हेलो चैंपियंस वेलकम टू द नेक्स्ट लेक्चर ऑन द सी एस आर नेट जुलाई ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी फाइव आई विल टेल यू द सेकेंड मेथड हाउ यू कैन सॉल्व द गिवन क्वेश्चन रिलेटेड टू द एल पी पी विद द हेल्प ऑफ द शॉर्टकट ट्विक्स माई सेफ डॉक्टर हरीश कर यू कैन फॉलो एंड सब्सक्राइब माई यूट्यूब चैनल वी यू कैन फाइंड द फर्स्ट लेक्चर ऑन द एल पी पी यू कैन सी द फर्स्ट मैथड हाउ यू कैन सॉल्व द प्रॉब्लम वाइल द मार्क ऑफ चेन कैलकुलस ऑफ वेरिएशन एंड मेनी मोर लेक्चर अवेलेबल इन दिस प्ले लिस्ट यू कैन सब्सक्राइब माई यूट्यूब चैनल फॉर मोर अपडेटेड वीडियोज Now look at this problem. Remember, student, your target is to maximize z is x plus y. And if you look about the options, they are also talking about the optimal solution. Is it fine? Now, how you can solve this question in the 15 second time period or 10 to 15 second time period? It's a very very simple question. The, you can get the answer if you already watch my previous lectures, PY question of the LPP, which is already available in this. playlist if you already watch that then you can get the answer in a very very simple manner what i told you in this lecture your target is to make the objective function what is objective function is x plus y from these three constraints that is only your target and how you can make them either you can add them either you can multiply any of the constraints by any positive number alpha beta or gamma Fine, so that you can try to make x plus y from these constants. Fine. So look at that. I we will see. Firstly, if you add them, it is my nine x plus nine minus one is a eight y, and it will be less than equal to sixty three. Fine. Now your target is x plus y. There are the two choices. Either you can write as a eight x plus eight y is less than sixty three minus x, or you can write as a 9x plus 9y which is less than of 63 plus y fine but make sure your target is to find the maximum value x is my positive so that number will be less than of because minus of x will be less than 0 is it okay is it okay now if you look about this case if i divide it by 9 it will be my 7 plus y over 9 and in this case it will be x plus y is less than of what is a 63 divided by 8 minus x now in order to find the max value we find the minimum value of x so that means this quantity will always because minus of x is less than 0 so that number is always less than of so this number will be my 8756 seven point something so that means the maximum value will be seven point something but in this case it is my four point cancel it will be seven, six point something again it will be cancel it's a seven to seven point something fine six is a four point is the cancel c is my right answer on the other hand for this case because y is my positive so the maximum value will always be you can see the maximum of x plus y will always be greater than of seven because y is my positive again you can see only the c option that is 85 over 12 which is more than 7 is the correct answer so this is the way you can solve by consider the two cases and you can get the answer in a very simple man for more detail you must watch about my this lectures and you can like and comment on this video as well for more updated video i will share you the next part very soon till then you can share this video with your friends like and comments best of luck students happy learning